tomorrow we got. <coughs> I'm not even gonna start again. Tomorrow we've got two spaces um, for the sparring. Two of the lads are working, so if you make it to Doncaster, five thirty start as always. Message me, let me know. The first two will be the two that that um, that will join him. So let me know. Thank you. Yeah, me. You know, I think I think uh, crowds will be back in. Maybe not full crowds, but crowds will be back in. So I think it's. Uh, I think it's a strong possibility it'll happen. Yeah, I'm really, I'm really looking forward to it. I hope it happens. I'm confident I'll win it. I think it's a really hard fight. I rate him, but I'm going to guess that this is not a boxing related question. Otherwise, you're doing it all wrong. But uh, I'm not a big fan of the term chin up. However, happiness is found in different places for different people. So uh, it's a very, it's a very hard question to answer. Peter trained me for a fight in 2014. Uh, but boxing aside, you know, Peter. Up there with Brendan Ingle um, and very few others that have that level of respect for, uh, just on a real level. I've not watched EastEnders for probably 10 years. Uh, my favourite as a kid, Phil Mitchell, is the all time great EastEnders character. Um, I like Mel, I like Lisa, I like Martin Fowler. Uh, I'm not sure he's level above, however, uh, I know it's a cliche, but styles do make fights. Dylan White beat me 10 rounds to nil, but I beat Lucas Brown four rounds quicker than him. So, you know, make of it what you will. It's a cliche, but it's true. I'd have to say Anthony Joshua, I did probably 500 rounds of him. I was never fit for any of them. I was severely overweight for all of them. I'd only had talent to fight, and I started sparring with him. Raw not this. But I learned how to survive, and uh, it fucking toughened me up. Yeah, me and Coogan are friends, like, boxing aside, uh, we we speak on the phone every now and again. Um, the difference between a mate and a friend is you, you you care about your friends. Your mates are your mates, but your friends, you you care for them, and I care for him. No mate, any size, body spine for everyone, all, all sizes and shapes and levels of experience. It's good for the boxers, it's good for the, the people that just want to come have a good crack. Uh, the other day we had kids 16, 17 stone, 13 stone, 9 stone, just whatever, it's all it's all good fun. He's he's only had three fights. Uh, I quite like the way he carries himself. He's confident, um, and I think he's a smart man as well. Like he knows what he's doing. You know what level he's at. He knows where he wants to go. And I'm not saying that he can't. He's good. So uh, be interesting. I think he is good though. You know what, mate? The, the honest truth of it is, exercise is nowhere near as important as your nutrition when it comes to losing weight. So my my advice would be to get your food right. I know you're away for twelve hours and it's hard, but prep your food, take it into work, and, and eat well. No, mate, the only time I've ever been in his company is um, when we sparred two rounds, 2000, 2016, July 2016, but um, he's shit-tight, isn't he? He's going to be fucking unbelievable. I'm a massive horse racing fan. Uh, I watch football, I watch the big games. Um, I like watching cricket, especially 2020, I like watching darts. At the minute, I'm massive into snooker, I'm watching snooker every day, I love it. Uh, I like old sports. You know what, mate, the, the thing that makes me the happiest, genuinely happiest, is when I see someone I care about happy. Uh, that's, that's for me, that's the ultimate. Uh, I like seeing confidence grow in people. I like watching them grow in confidence. Yeah, we, we sparred about 500 rounds all together. Um, I never dropped him and he never dropped me, and I probably won about five out of 500 rounds, but um, it was fucking hard work. <sighs> No, like I agree with you, mate. He looks the real deal, but he shouldn't be number two. You know, he's beat Nathan Gorman. That's his best win. That's his only real good big win. And Nathan's a really good fighter, but he's not got any. He's not got any big wins on his record. So um, I don't know what Eddie fought, mate. But um, I took the fight. I watched Tony Oka five week before I had concussions. I was fucked. I watched it where and I wasn't fit. I was in a bad way, but I still know I'd be him. So. I've known Joe probably eight years now since my first assessment on the Great Britain squad and um, you know you get some stick and people say he's slow and all this but he's a funny clever man uh, I like the fella you know what mate I've never I don't know him on a personal level at all I've never spoke to him or nothing um, but I'd, I've watched probably his last five or six fights and follow him on Instagram so I guess I'm a little bit of a fan but I don't know yeah, there's the two Aiden brothers who the video was on earlier. They've had one amateur bout between them. They were, uh, 
you think they've got at least five or ten each. There's two brothers, two Fox brothers, the same with them. Uh, the the levels shock me actually. They're good. You know what, mate? I don't. Um, I sleep I sleep on the living room floor with the telly and that. So I just turn it off and go sleep as soon as I turn it off. It's about eleven or twelve. Wake up about eight. So that's eight or nine hours, isn't it? So I accidentally do well. Yeah, you know, I've got um, a mate of mine, little sister. She's nine. She came down to the session last week. Um, and she's going to come on to twice a week. And you know what? She's really good. Women have got really good balance and coordination. So they pick it up quicker than men. For me, um, Aspie Cat Slater. I mean, there's a lot of beautiful women that's been in the show. But Cat Slater for me. Do you know what I mean? Um, bit of me. Uh, a state statement is usually uh, words based on fact. But you don't know what I'm getting paid if the fact came off. So... Your statement is actually just a sentence of bollocks. Uh, any fight I take from here on, I, I fancy winning. Um, you know what, I didn't always sleep in the bed anyway, but um, when Jay was here and Liam, I only had two beds, so I'd give them a bed each, and I started sleeping on the floor, and um, I, just, I just carried on doing it, I guess, when I'm home. You know what, mate, I used to put... Um, I used to put that before my own training, but now, you know what, when they're doing the nine miles tomorrow morning, we're doing, I'm going to do it with them. The husband's in with them this morning, so as much as I'm trying to help them out, they're helping me, they're pushing me, keeping me fit, so it's good. Well, basically, I see you with Fiori as like a, as a, Premier, as a solid Premier League team. Babbage is like an upcoming League Two side. If I beat you with Fiori, I might get into Europa League. If I beat Babbage, I'm still stuck in League One or Two, so we'll see.